Hi everyone, welcome to today's trade of the day and for today's trade of the day we will be looking at the pound dollar. Right, so what I have here is uh, the pound dollar on the weekly chart. I just want to show all of you that on the weekly, right, the pound dollar has already broken above uh, significant swing high resistance right at this area. Okay, ignoring the spikes, all right, in close, all right, we can see that price is clearly above the last swing high resistance. So with that, we should expect price to push higher. Okay, we, we should expect price to push higher. On the daily, it's a bit unclear. Okay, um, however, we know that price is generally in an uptrend because price makes a series of higher lows. Right, so very quickly, um, <coughs> let's go down to the 4 hours. So on a 4 hour time frame, right, we see that the market is actually sort of going sideways within a consolidation phase. Okay, and uh, while we are already above the weekly uh, swing high, alright, the moment price actually breaks out, okay, um, of this range clearly to the upside we can expect price to go that much higher all right so we can actually use a fibonacci extension to find a target price using these three points point one point two point three open all fibonacci ratios all right we see that the uh, hundred percent is over here at the spike the recent swing high Right, so I'm going to change that to red for resistance. But of course, the next key level is the 161.8. Alright, so that can be our possible target. Of course, the Fibonacci levels in the middle can be our partial take profit. Alright. <clears throat> so let me highlight the key Fibonacci ratios of 100% and 161.8. So we have our entry, right? We just have to wait for price to break above this level. Okay, and then we can play up to the take profit. Now, what we have to do is to look for our stop loss. Let's go down to the one hour. Because price is quite choppy, right? We can use this line, uh, this weekly support okay, as sort of a, a guide. A guide, okay? Now we see price doing a current push up right so we can use fibonacci retracement from the low to where price currently is and open all fibonacci levels now we see the 50 percent is actually quite in line with our weekly support level not surprisingly also the negative 2720 is also in line with our for our 100 percent fibonacci extension and our graphical spike right so this is a very strong level to be watching out for so i'm just going to highlight the 50 percent and the negative 2720. Okay, so this weekly support is going to serve as our stop loss. Right, the, the, the idea here is we wait for price to break above the, sorry, the idea here is that we wait for price to break above the buy entry and then we can go long right towards our take profit. All right, because um, price is above already above the weekly support okay so a close above the weekly support confirms that you know the weekly trend should go higher uh, but on the shorter term the intraday we do have a roadblock over here with this spike and strong fibonacci confluence area which is why our buy stop entry is over there all right so once price triggers our buy entry the remember the stop loss is dynamic we can actually protect our position by moving our stop loss to break even Alright, so thanks everyone for tuning in to today's trade of the day. Uh, we're playing the bullish push in line with the weekly on the pound dollar. And I'll catch you guys again the next time round. Thank you.